Alrighty, hi my collective. So I wanted to come on here and say this message found you because you're being ungrateful. You don't have your manifestations that you desire because you're already being ungrateful in your current life. And I'm your big sister who's gonna tell you like it's it like it is, because I'm a big sister in real life. I don't I don't sugarcoat it for my brothers and I'm not gonna sugarcoat it for you. If I'm being completely honest, we need to be in gratitude for the things that we currently have. And if you continue to look at the things that you don't have, that means you're in lack. That means you're in the frequency of not receiving what you desire. So if you truly want to re receive everything that you want, you have to find the good in your day. Start your morning with gratitude. End your morning. End your day with gratitude. So if you get up in the morning, you say, "I'm grateful to be alive," and you find and you set the intention. You light your incense. You're like, you know what? Today's gonna be a good day. You know, I woke up this morning, lit my incense, and I put on that song, "Lovely day, lovely day, lovely day." And I'm promise you, no matter what the fuck happens, it's gonna be a good day regardless. You're telling the universe that, you know what, she, she's appreciative. I'm going to give her more shit. Because if you think about it, anytime you give somebody a gift, you say, hey, here you go, I bought you this. And they're just like, mm, actually, I like it in the color of green. I'm not going to give you nothing else. I'm going to let this bitch ungrateful. You have to think about it in that in that sense. So be grateful for, for what you have. If you have a roof over your head, be grateful for that. Gratitude gets you where you want to go. So being grateful for what you currently have while also manifesting more. But you have to currently be in gratitude. So this message is for the people who are or you, you still finding something wrong with something. <laughs> spirit is saying you're still finding something wrong with something i'm trying to give you your dream life but you're still finding something wrong with something y'all like even if you 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 just made the biggest decision of your life and you don't know how the hell it's gonna work out just be grateful that you even made that decision that you jumped and you did that so some of you guys you really need healthy boundaries with your mind is what spirit is saying healthy boundaries with your mind so figure out what it is that you need to stop thinking about because i know you know like anytime worry comes in anytime doubt comes in on being ungrateful comes in dead that shit <laughs> there's something you could be grateful for and you can literally visualize anything that you want so if you want to live a lavish lifestyle what do you have the tools that you have right now that can create that put on jazz music in the background while you're soaking and um doing your self-care routine like literally it is just that simple and then you visualize that you're in your your mansion doing whatever the hell you want whatever the hell that you desire but you can make it out of what you have your imagination remember when you was younger and you was um pretending that you was a i don't know a teacher or you was pretending that you um you you owned a mansion whatever it is what when you're young kids have such a nice imagination they don't even care if they just play with sticks and rocks they still making a, a palace out of sticks and rocks so and you have more than that shit because i know if you're watching this video you have a phone so you have something so put on some music in the background that's going uplift your mood like if you want to manifest things you're not going to manifest it on the frequency of woe is me the universe hates me the universe doesn't care if you're a dog cat um a tree it just knows what your frequency is and if your frequency is being ungrateful then you won't get nothing else so <laughs> this message is for y'all who who keep on wishing upon a star thinking you're gonna get it by just being pessimistic no baby and i'm gonna be honest with you like i used to be pessimistic and <laughs> life just kept fucking me just get fucking me like literally so now i'm optimistic as fuck. it's everything works out for me it always does like it that's just the lifestyle that i'm living <laughs> and you can make anything happen anything is possible you need to believe in yourself and you th you need to you need to just switch your frequency up babes like I, this message is for y'all who just keep on waiting 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 for things to change but you're not doing the changing you have to realize that we are also the co-creators so if you're if spirit seeing you cultivating peace out of what you don't have out of the little that you have then you can be blessed with more buy you some incense light that bitch get put on a nice frequency in the background sit in your room meditate radiate love whatever it is that you gotta do but just do that with what you have every time you focus on what you don't have then you're gonna stay in that frequency you're not gonna you're not even gonna be able to see what's in front of you even if i did bless you with the house you'd be like oh my god well that house too small but you know it really goes back down to when they talk about how like materialistic things cannot bring you happiness because you will just find the next thing to complain about or the next thing to move on up to it really starts from within so cultivating that peace with what you have right now that gratitude for what you have right now and knowing that 
your blessings are on the way and it's coming okay it's coming but you have to be grateful for what you have right now if you can't be grateful for this you won't be grateful for the next thing you'll find something else that's wrong with it so sleeping with subliminals that say for gratitude anything you can do so even if you're finding it hard reprogram your mind brainwash yourself into believing that you're grateful because anything you got to do you got to do it you've done all the other crap before all the other trauma before you can at least commit to this new lifestyle you can commit to this new way of living okay so gratitude be grateful okay thank you guys for listening to my um ted talk and my rants and i love you guys share this with somebody who needs to be grateful in their life okay i love you <laughs>